YorkCountyDining.com presents The White Rose Cooking Show. <coughs> the spirits! <laughs> the spirits are talking in Now, if you have brought any of those spirits in with you, Make sure they are silent. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, terribly sorry. Um, has everyone enjoyed themselves this evening so far? <laughs> yes, sir. Turhan uh, was uh, probably talking about uh, uh, your pocket telephone devices. Bit Brilliant! Of Actually, I can't believe that you don't have to have trunk numbers or crank your dial. That's wonderful. Uh, but uh, if it beeps, rings, Vibrates, moves around, I don't care if it's your husband, turn him off. Um, Pacemakers awesome. that make noise, turn him off. Miss, uh, Miss Daisy uh, is a very gracious hostess, uh, and she has uh, strict rules, uh, social rules of behavior for any of her guests. It's called uh, etiquette. Yes, so uh, mm -hmm. the first and foremost is that once the doors are closed, uh, you may not leave the room. Uh, and so if, uh, if you haven't, <laughs> too late now. You know. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, also, um, I know that there are a great deal of amateur photographers in America, um, but the amount of smoke that is given off uh, from a trestle of flash powder is not only a fire hazard, uh, but it is an allergen that can also pollute the lungs. So, uh, no flash photography, please. At no time. No time. Uh, no flash photography, especially in front of Miss Daisy. No flashing. Yes, don't flash Miss Daisy. No, that's not what I meant. Uh, yes, no. Now I have to start over. Has everyone enjoyed themselves? No. no. So, uh, uh, you have to stay in the room. Uh, no flash photography, no bloody beeping things, or I'll hit you with a ball peen hammer. Um, uh, what's the other one? Um, no, no smoking in the room. No flash photography, no yes. leaving the room. Leaving the room. Um, Yes, so stick you like a wet finger in an electrical socket. <laughs> yes, uh, never stick anything inside your ear except your ear. Well, Daisy, it does appear okay. as if uh, all of your guests, most of your guests have been oh, seen. I'm frightfully mm -hmm. sorry, Mr. Van mm -hmm. Daisy, excuse me, we're just uh, mm -hmm. setting up the rules, as it? Yeah. Well, sorry. <laughs> Welcome! <laughs> Welcome, one and all! <laughs> We have a bit of the gravest business to attend to this evening and uh, shall be calling upon all of you for your assistance. But first, Daisy, I know that uh, our engagement was only announced days ago, but being that Valentine's is upon us, I, I thought that... Uh, yes, I thought that we should get mad right now. Thank you, Daisy. We'll be married and happy, and that happiness is just the type of pure endoplasmic energy that we can use to contact your ectoplasmic Uncle Charles. Do you really think it could, Victor? I would stake my reputation as one of the world's foremost mentalists upon it. <laughs> Moral, I would stake my love for you on it. As well. Oh, Victor, you're a positively lovely man. You take my breath away. <laughs> Not yet, I don't. Pardon? I meant, <laughs> I meant that we have a long and happy life ahead of us, is all. Now then, let us proceed with the nuptials. Oh. oh, good fortune follows us, Daisy, for there is a clergyman here this evening to perform the ceremony. Reverend, Reverend, if you would be so kind. Yes, Victor, my son. <laughs> Turn around, Reverend. I, I know you forgot yours at home. So here you are. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Now, Reverend, this is a, a family heirloom handed down through the generations. Uh, my great 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 grandfather Howard Johnson gave it to me. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is a book I've read before. I would hope so. <laughs> and in fact, if you can't read it, perhaps it's memorized. <laughs> 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 
to you, Victor, on Lustig. Take L Lustig. 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 Yeah. Close enough. Take Miss <laughs> Daisy Grubb to be your lawful wedded wife. I do. <laughs> Okay, do you, Miss Daisy Krupp, take Victor von Lustig to be your lawfully wedded husband? This is a solemn moment. No, We haven't gotten to that part yet where you get to state your objections. <laughs> it would be terribly impossible if I didn't say that I was I do. Hmm. Really? <laughs> <laughs> uh, just read. <laughs> then by the powers vested in me, I pronounce you man and wife. Oops, we must have skipped that other part. Victor, <laughs> 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 not in front of all these people. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, we should save that for our wedding room. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you very much, Reverend. That was very kind of you. I'll take that back.